it's a film about the potential of life. I, I, I think I want people to not shut themselves off and go out there and uh, experience because it's very easy to stay in your comfort zone and stay inside and uh, but to really um, life's too short for that and go out and, and do it. Uh, it's, it's it's a lot about uh, what I went through at the time like when I was writing it uh, I think that was two years ago um, I wouldn't say it I mean this is a very extremely uh, apathetic guy uh, I wasn't I'm, I have my social life is fine. I'm, I'm, I'm you know, I'm a happy, happy guy. Uh, but um, I wanted to because I was feeling uh, it was kind of a time where I was a bit lost and a bit. I didn't really feel the the motivation to go out a lot, and uh, that's how I came up with this. I just want to make a film about an extremely uh, emotionless, passionless guy, um, and I just wanted to put him in a place that is just beautiful and a place that should get anyone excited, but it doesn't excite him. Like. And that's that. I just wanted to put that character in that place and see what happens. That was the uh, idea. Because uh, uh, I think he was just great. Because when I watched his show reel, I really wanted a, a very special face. I, I know that might sound cliche, but uh, like a, a face that just makes you. Because the film is basically his um, face. <laughs> that's basically it. And it's also his face doing uh, very little. I kept having to tell him, just don't do anything with your. Um, Face and he had in his uh, showreel a couple of scenes where this kind of uh, confused, lost uh, thing came across. Um, but he is actually, when I met him, a really social guy, which is just very. And it was hard f f for us uh, at first to tone him down and make him really. At one point, I just said, "Just do do nothing with your face." And then, but then he started to. At first, he didn't trust me at all. He was like, "What do you mean? I'm an actor. You have to." to act and do things. But then I told him, yeah, just, it's, trust me. And then after a while, we, we got in the groove of doing very little with our, with his face. And then, yeah, that's his character. <laughs> uh, we shot in a, in a, in a, in a, um, in a foreign country. We shot in Spain uh, and we uh, had uh, a budget. Uh, we, we raised over Kickstarter of 20,000 euros, um, which of course is very little also when you have to get a crew over. And nobody got paid, and everybody was in this uh, for the film, and really for. All. Um, so I guess the challenge was, uh, I guess everything. But but I, I I'm saying it sounds like it was really hard to. It was the, like the, the best thing I've ever. Like the people that came together were just close friends, and uh, and uh, everybody knew it was going to be like that. We have to work long hours. We have to. Um, for three weeks, but I mean, we we were in Spain, and the sun was shining, so it was too bad. Well, I think so far we're, we're really getting a, um, a lot of great uh, feedback on, on that personal level where they say we really, um, it really uh, gave them a positive outlook on, on, and that's really what I wanted to do with the film, I think. I never wanted to, I mean, I wrote the script when I was 22, so I never felt like I wanted to write a film where, you know, give the audience a life lesson of how to, because it's all about finding what's what, how to live your life, but I never wanted to really point the finger and say, this is how you should uh, live your life, because I, I have no idea myself. But um, I think I just wanted to create a sort of three characters that are just searching for uh, how to go about everything and just approaching it, but all of them, in a way, approach it in a positive way. Rain and it's really just, uh, I thought it's crazy also, considering the the amount of submissions this year and this record number of 8,000 films and then we're, we're not only in it but also nominated. It's, it's, it's so weird. I, 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 I told um, the, the director um, of the festival yesterday how, uh, how amazing it is that Raindance does that for such small films and uh, to really give them a platform to show it. And yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm still, yeah, I'm very, very happy about this.